Hey, I'm home. Phone kai mera. Hello, salam and namaste. Welcome back to another tech video with me, Asad Virani. All of you who have liked the previous videos, thank you for that. And those who are new can check out my older videos here. You know the rules of the game, yeah? Hit like, comment, subscribe and hit the bell icon so that I get some encouragement to make new videos for you and you will remain updated with my new releases. I'm sure most of you must have at least once skipped a heartbeat when you realize that you don't have your phone with you and you have lost it. Many of you have been fortunate to have found your phone in between your car seats or your home cushion or from your office. There are some who have been unfortunate by forgetting their phones in a cab or must have got it stolen. What would you do if you realize that you have lost your phone? Would you panic or would you get technology to work for you? Let me share with you a personal incident that happened a few days ago. I had been for a conference and as usual conferences are really boring. That made me very sleepy. So I booked an Uber to get back home and on the way in the cab I went to sleep. When I woke up, I reached my destination, I was still a bit sleepy. I got back home and the moment I reached out for my phone to say, OK, Google, turn on the lights, I realized I didn't have my phone. I took my wife's phone and immediately contacted Uber. Uber very kindly gave me the driver's number. I called the driver and I said that I've missed my phone. I think it's there in your car. And he said, give it a call. I called the phone and it was ringing, but he says he couldn't hear it. It struck me that I had put the phone on silent and I forgot to put it off silent. Now, I had a panic attack. I didn't want to lose my phone. However, I said, let me try some other ways out. I got hold of the driver the phone was ringing, he was talking to me, but we were unable to trace the phone. So I thought, I said to myself, Asad, don't panic. Let's try to find the phone. However, I'm not a Sherlock Holmes or a James Bond. Suddenly, a bulb went on in my mind and it said, hey, why don't you take help of your friend Google? I immediately took my laptop and logged on to android.com forward slash find. Within seconds, it tracked my phone and it showed me on the Google map that my phone is approximately 15 to 20 minutes away from my location. Google gave me three options, play sound, secure device, erase device so I called the driver once again and I asked him can he hear my phone he said no boss I can't hear your phone I said okay be quiet and let me do some tricks I clicked on the button that said play sound and what the phone started ringing and I could hear the phone through the driver's phone and he was kind enough to stop the car and look for the phone and he found the phone under the seat. He then apologized and said that he can drop off the phone back to me as soon as he gets some passenger for my area. Since I was desperate to get my phone back, I said, don't worry, I'll pay you the charges. Please come back immediately. And he did and I got my phone back. What a sigh of relief. Look. I was fortunate to get my phone back with just a few clicks and a few phone calls. If you realize your phone was stolen and you can still track the phone, don't try to retrieve it yourself. Go to the police station, explain to them the whole case and with their help, you can track your phone back. 
the max they will ask you is for the IMEI number of your phone to prove that it is genuinely yours. You can get hold of the IMEI number by looking at your original purchase invoice or again Google can help you. When you search for your phone in Android Find, you see an exclamation mark next to your phone model number. Click on it and it will give you your IMEI number. So the three options that Google gives are play sound. Now even if your phone is on silent, it will still play a loud sound for five full minutes until you stop it or the person over there stops it. Second option is secure phone. Just imagine you don't have a screen lock on your phone. What happens? Anybody can access your personal data be it your photos, your emails, or even your phone book. So the second option helps you to lock your phone and also put a message on the lock screen saying that, hey, please call me and you put down your number. You can put any message you want in two lines. The third option is erase data. Mind you, this is very sensitive. If you click on erase data, Google will clear your phone, will format your phone and you will never be able to trace it back. You can do this only if you realize that you are unable to trace your phone back, it's gone in somebody's wrong hands and you will never ever be able to retrieve it back. <laughs> Looks like a James Bond movie right so far? No, it's not a movie. It's true. It's technology. Google to your rescue. But Google can only help you if 1. Your phone is still on 2. Your phone is connected to mobile data or Wi-Fi 3. Location setting is switched on in your phone and not switched off and 4. The phone needs to have a Google account which you will use to connect to your phone to search for it from another laptop so make sure these four things are always on on your phone when you are out of your home so that if unfortunately something like this happens you are able to retrieve your phone back very easily people ask why do we need a screen lock okay so screen lock comes handy in such situations a screen lock not just prevents your phone from accidentally typing something while it's in your pocket but it will also help you in such unforeseen circumstances when your phone has been stolen the stealer will not be able to switch off your phone so you can still track your phone through google the stealer will not be able to turn off your mobile data which again is needed to track your phone so my friends always have a screen lock though it may be a very simple combination of numbers or a design but don't make it very obvious. I hope you have made a note of all the contents of this video and this should help you in any such unfortunate situation. You now know the rules of the game. Hit like, comment, subscribe hit the bell icon and share this video with your friends. Thank you.